Oh shit. Oh yeah. That's right, Tifa. Oh, limit break. Here we go. Oh, it's me, Cruz. Geeks and to hoots and dudettes, my name is TV Geek and welcome back to another reaction video. Alright dude, so this has been requested to me on numerous occasions on the comment section on my Ruby reactions. Now why Ruby reactions? Because there's a certain character involved in this death battle. Yes, dudes, this is going to be a death battle between two iconic characters from two fictional stories. One from Ruby, my Super Saiyan goddess, Yang, versus a Final Fantasy VII legend, Tifa. This is going to be an extremely awesome battle, dudes. I can't believe I never watched this one. Well, again, I suppose that would be believable because, uh, because I never actually watched Ruby before until a couple of weeks ago, but now knowing that Yang is involved in this death battle, it gets me extremely excited. Plus, Tifa, knowing that I am a huge Final Fantasy fan, and especially Final Fantasy VII, that was the best Final Fantasy in my opinion, in story-wise and character-wise, and it's going to be amazing to see two iconic characters such as these Battle it out to see who is the ultimate fighter. This is going to be so cool, dudes. I'm super pumped for this, guys. I really am. So I'm not going to waste any more time. So without further ado, let's react to this death battle. Alright, dude, so I'm just after watching the first part of the video explaining the characters' abilities and their backgrounds and stuff like that, just giving us a comparison between the two opponents. It's going to be interesting to see this death battle, dude. So without further ado, let's watch this. Here we go. Three, two, one, boom! It's death battle time. Here all we right, go. The combatants are set. Let's end this debate once and for all. Yeah, let's time do it. For a death battle! Hell yes! Oh yeah. I'm really excited for this. Oh, ho, ho, there Hold she up. is. Let me see some ideas. There's your ID. <laughs> Hello. No need to panic, people. Just looking for someone. I will take a strawberry sunrise, though. No ice. Thanks. Oh. Sorry, miss. Oh, shit. Here we go. So, does this mean no sunrise? Oh, my God. It's actually yeah. happening. Whoa. I don't know who to root for. Tifa was a childhood crush back in the day, in my Final Fantasy days. But Yang is my new born crush. <laughs> Whoa! Wow, this is awesome! This is exactly how I hoped it to be! Yo! I'm going to blow you out of the water! Oh shit, here we go! Oh! <laughs> Oh damn, you pissed her off now, Tifa. Not even close. Oh my god, I wonder who's gonna win, I have no idea. This is awesome, dude. <laughs> it's the Yang soundtrack as well. Oh shit. Oh yeah. That's right, Tifa. 
All right. Let's see if you can keep up. Oh, limit break! Here we go! Oh, it's Beat Rush! And Water Kick and Meteor Drive! Oh my god, so many memories are being brought back right now. Oh no, Yang! Did I just explode? <laughs> oh, oh. Gun super! Yes! Oh no, Tifa, you messed with the wrong girl! No! Nailed it. <laughs> yes! Cross another potential wife off the list. Oh my god. Honestly, I didn't know who to root for. More experienced than Yang. But Yang's semblance quickly turned all Tifa's power against her. Even the Minerva Band, the best of Tifa's armor options to counter Yang's strength and shotgun blast, was eventually overtaken by the semblance. Plus, while Tifa could lift creatures many times heavier than Cloud using her limit breaks, she never shows this kind of strength anywhere else, implying that this power is exclusive to those limit breaks rather than something she possesses naturally. That's and true. Even though Tifa's premium heart increased in power over time, they reset after her limit breaks while Yang's That's power so kept true. on rising. However, Yang's real trump card was her aura. Her semblance would have been useless if she could not survive Tifa's attacks. Luckily, her aura is durable enough to take a punch that shattered a concrete pillar about That's four so feet true. wide, a feat which requires at least 1,400 tons of force. Wow! That's the equivalent I of love the facts! 360 jetliners fall on your face. Yang's power just pulled through in a snap. The winner is Yang Xiaolong. My Super Saiyan Goddess. Wow. Oh, oh my god, dudes. That was incredible. What a battle between two iconic characters of the fictional world of Ruby and Final Fantasy. Oh my god, that was incredible. Honestly, dudes, I didn't know who to root for. I mean, like I said before, Tifa has always been, we'll say, a childhood crush or sweetheart when I was a kid because I used to play Final Fantasy 7 a lot and I really, really liked her character. And as she developed in the story as well, I really grown so attached to her and... To see her brought back into something like this was amazing. But then we have Yang, someone that I've only recently found on YouTube. And I've been a massive fan of Ruby now that I am. In the last couple of weeks, that's how quick it's been. But it's so nice to see those two like battle it out. And I think... I, I honestly think Screw Attack done a great job in putting this together. And the facts that they put out there as well, they make a lot of sense. It would make sense why Tifa struggled a lot against Yang. I mean, her semblance is extremely powerful. And the fact that she had aura, she was able to survive all the limit breaks from Tifa. And eventually Tifa was completely run down from using all those limit breaks. And Yang was still standing and then boom. And it's decided. Yang is the winner. This was awesome. I thoroughly enjoyed this. I really did. It was incredible to see this fight. And thank you again so much to any of you guys that recommended this to me. I enjoyed it. I love watching this kind of stuff. Two fictional characters clashing it out to see who's number one. And it's amazing. And Screw Attack do a phenomenal job in doing that. And if you guys want to check out Screw Attack's channel, I'll leave a link in the description box. Check them out. These guys are awesome. They've got so many death battles. I've seen a lot of them as well. And they're just amazing. But anyway, dudes, I'm going to end this reaction video here. I hope you dudes enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a like, a thumbs up. And that'd be super awesome. And if you guys want to be a part of the BG community and join me here every day, there's an upload of something interesting, something Ruby related. Bollywood related anything entertainment I got it so if you want to be a part of that it's very simple what you need to do and that sting that subscribe button and I'd be super awesome also and as always dudes stay geeky stay cool be awesome be happy and I'll see you in my next video